Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Guys, I would like to congratulate a goose W underscore Ortiz for winning this Babolat Pure Arrow VS. Uh, a goose, congratulations. This racket will be heading out to you real soon um, in Spain. So congratulations, a goose in Spain. Today, I'm going to be talking about the best strings on the market, natural gut. Now, we all know natural gut is made from a natural fiber. If you didn't, I just taught you. So what is a natural fiber? Well, it comes out of a cat. Nah, just kidding. Yeah, everybody calls it cat gut. They still come in and say, hey, do, you, do they still make cat gut? And I'm like, yeah, no. Uh, cat gut is for violins. You know, when you go meow, 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 meow. Nah, just kidding. So <laughs> gut really comes from a cow. It's actually a cow intestine. So I know some people eat that. I know in my culture, we eat that. But they make tennis strings out of cow intestines. So this pack of Babolat natural gut comes from a cow. And it's from their intestines. It's a long process, which I believe takes about 30 to 90 days to process. Um, it's a lot of pulling and drawing, pulling and drawing. Um, it's kind of like making pasta, but you know, in a 30, like in a 30 day cycle, it's a pulling and letting it rest, pulling and letting it rest so that you get the elasticity from this string. That's why no other string on the market can match this because it's a natural fiber. It has a natural stretch. You can't recreate that with nylon or polyester. It won't have the same feel. Now, so people always ask me, right? I like the feel of gut. Um, how long will it last? Well, it really depends on how, how you take care of it, right? You can't get it wet. So if you live in a place that's, you know, like tropical, um, Hawaii, maybe Florida, where it's humid, that gut's not gonna last, right? Have your strings ever looked like this? If, you, if you've gotten gut before, right? When that water, the moisture uh, seeps into the gut, it starts to fray faster, right? When it starts to fray faster, it means it's soaking in the water. It, that water, that water causes the strings to loosen up because it does not like water. It just absorbs it and then lets go of tension. So gut has to be taken care of. You have to bring it into the house don't leave it in the car. That heat is going to make it loose and it's going to make it loose fast. So you got to treat it well. Um, if you're going to leave it in your bag, bring the bag in the house because it is susceptible to climates. Um, sometimes I see strings like the gut broken in the corners, right? At certain tensions, um, Recently, over 60 pounds, I've seen strings just break by itself prematurely. Um, have you ever had a gut string, right? You pull it out of the bag or you pull it out of the garage three, six months later and it's broken, maybe here and here or here and here. You know, like it's usually in the corners where it breaks because it's the most extreme angle for the strings. Um, that's probably gut because it doesn't like being sedentary either. Um, gut likes to be used. It likes to be stretched. So when you play with it, you're stretching it out, right? Kind of like your body likes to be moved, like to be stretched. When gut is not used, 
it becomes um, brittle. When gut is not used, it becomes brittle, therefore causing premature breakage. So if you leave gut in storage for anywhere from a month to a year, don't expect that gut to remain intact. Uh, it'll probably be broken by the time you pull it out. So if you leave it in the winter, um, like let's say in November, and go back to it in March, it's probably broken, okay? And it's because it's gut that it's broken. No other material out there will, will break like that. It just doesn't like to be sedentary. So why does gut play so well? Why do you get the feel from the gut? Well, it's because it's a natural fiber, right? You take an intestine that's stretchable versus something that's not, therefore you're automatically getting, I, I wanna say at least 10% more power. You're getting at least 10% more feel. Um, they just can't replicate it in any other string. So therefore gut kind of stands by itself as the top of all strings. If you've never tried it um, and you want to, definitely try it. Uh, it's not cheap, but it's a treat, okay? So if you wanna treat yourself to the best thing out there in tennis strings, gut is the way to go. Um, if you wanna go kind of halfway in do like the Fed setup, the Djokovic setup, where you put the gut on the main and put either a synthetic or a poly on the cross. That'll give you the feel of gut without having to get a whole set of gut or a, a full bed of gut. Um, that'll kind of give you, you know, what, what it is, um, how it plays and what it feels like. So are all guts made the same? No. The best gut is probably this Babylon out there. It's made in France. They have a factory, they have a plant that specifically makes natural gut. And they've been doing it for probably over 100 years. So they've got it down. So this is the best gut out there. Holds tension well feels great, um, you know, has the best feel. It, it's just a great all around gut. This is like the, the king of guts right here, the Babolat. Now Wilson used to have Babolat make their gut. Um, they don't anymore. This is now made in Belgium uh, where they make chocolates. No, just kidding. It's, it's probably made in the Luxalon factory now. Um, this it, Luxlon's probably making this for them since it's made in Belgium. And it, it's, not, it's not quite there, but it's actually really, really good. It, if this is A quality, this is like A minus quality. Um, it's just a hair firmer, just, just a hair. Um, I would say this lasts a little longer. It holds tension a little longer, but this is softer. Luxalon uh, started making a gut I want to say four or five years ago, um, I tried it out when it was when it was for when it first came out, and I was really excited about trying it out because you know Luxalon, you know they're they're the king of polyesters, uh, so I said okay, well maybe it's going to be a good gut. Uh, when I tried it, I didn't really like it. It was too stiff. It didn't have the same elasticity or feel or comfort as a regular gut. So that's my least favorite of all the top end natural guts. Um, there's another company called Clip out there that makes a natural gut. That's actually not bad. I've tried that one before. It's probably a distant fourth, eh, distant third in terms of uh, natural guts being made. They also make a, a naked gut, which is uncoated. So that you really have to be careful of because these strings, the Babolat, the Wilson, and the Luxalon gut uh, has a, like a clear coat on those strings to protect it from the elements. 
So the uncoated string I see is made by Clip. Um, they actually make a good string. With that string that's uncoated, you do have to take extra, extra care of that. Because as soon as moisture hits that, it's gonna get absorbed. Uh, and it's gonna get, like, it's gonna get brittle, right? And it's gonna stretch. And it will break or possibly break prematurely if not lose tension real quickly. If you've never tried natural gut, try either one of these two. These are going to be the best bet. Um, if, you, if you're addicted to gut and you're price sensitive, go for that clip. The clip is a, you know, a good gut. It's a good gut. Not as good as these, but it's a good gut. Um, there was a brand called Pacific back in the day that also made a really good gut. I haven't seen that in a while, so I don't know if they're still producing uh, natural gut. But if you've never tried it, hey, it's a treat. If you're addicted to it, well, hope you're rich. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.